Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with episode 50 of Skyrim. Alright, I didn't think I'd get this far in this series. Okay. Scorm Snowstrider's Journal. 13th of Sun... 13th of Sun's Dusk. I'm not reading all the rest of that numbers. At the command of Lord Harold, we have swept our company to the south edge of our territories in an attempt to drive the Snow Elves up north to the main host of his forces. The first few days met with heavy resistance, but as we approached the eastern edge of Lake Honneth, we have seen little and less of them. 21st of Sun's Dusk. We've begun to receive reports of attacks back around Lake Honneth, and word has come from the front that we should pull back, to be sure that we are not leaving our rear exposed. It's never a good thing, especially, you know, <laughs> in that sort of situation. If there is a stronghold of elves here, we will surely root them out. 27th of Sun's Dusk. It sounds impossible, but we have appeared to stumble upon... We have appeared to have stumbled upon a massive horde of the holdout of the dragon cultists. Motherfucker, I can't speak English. Who were believed to be wiped out during the dragon war. The elves must wait, as this is a threat we cannot ignore. If we are quick, we may be able to catch them unaware and avoid a lengthy siege. 21st of Evening Star. Third week of the siege, the men grow restless. restless. The man woe westless with the cold and all who miss, them, miss their families. If that blasted storm hadn't caught us off guard and slowed our ascent, we might have taken the monastery. But as it stands, we may be in for several more weeks of pounding on their walls. I've sent word to Harold to send one of the voice masters to help bring down the wall. Whoa, that'll be fun. Fourth of Morning Star. We brought down their main gate thanks to the young voice master, but the brash lad took an arrow in the neck in the process. Ugh. It seems he will be joining the eight in Sovngarde soon. The cultists have fallen back to the interior of the monastery, but soon enough we will breach those defenses. The sooner the better. It's too blasted cold on this mountain. I bet. Fifth of Morning Star. We entered the monastery today only to find all inside dead. It appears they purposefully caved in the stairway to the refectory and then took their own lives. Some appear to have slit their own wrists, others we found with empty vials. Most appear to be poisoned, but oddly, there are not as many empty vials as one would expect by the number of dead. We shall hold up here over the night rather than face the cold and explore the catacombs in the morning to see if we can find another passage to the upper areas. Sixth of Morning Star. May the eight protect us from dragons and madmen. We lost half our remaining men today. We discovered a well in the catacombs locked, but with several buckets already filled, and in their excitement for a drink that didn't risk frostbite on their tongue, two score drank before we could stop them. Gods only knows how these cultists could use that horrible poison in their own water supply. We've lost more men to this catastrophe than we did taking the courtyard. The well was locked from this side, and the key must be somewhere in the catacombs. But with the ghosts of these dead cultists and the men demoralized, it just isn't worth the search. Let those gods forsaken cultists drink their way to oblivion and be done with it. The upper door of the courtyard has some sort of barrier over it, and our mages believe that the sacrifice made here will sustain it for the decades at least. We leave this accursed place tomorrow to regroup and push up north, but I will leave this journal, so that in an age or so, when the poison has faded, someone may find yet find a way to be in to be sure. Ah, uh, in to be sure the cultists met their due fate. I cannot speak anything. I apologize. I'll take that for now. Ooh, chest. Didn't even see that the first time. Uh, open, you little shit. Fucking ding dog a who. There we go. That's the way. Yay! Pentacle stamina and gold. Anything else around here that I could be using? Yeah, not that. Fly Amanita. No, 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 no. That's uh, some gold and burial urns. That's about it. It's a lot of good that does. Uh, okay, we'll proceed further then. And I'm fairly certain this will have a bunch of people. Yep. I was not wrong. Okay. Well, I thought he'd be getting closer. Oh, now I have you cornered, buddy. 
down we go. Woo! And I got a thing for that. Whoop! Almost forgot the uh, dagger. I'm collecting these while I'm here. Because they look cool. Yep. Those were all empty, and I still looked in them anyway, because I'm an idiot. <laughs> That's apparently what the thing I'm doing is, being an idiot. More swords, huh? That's weird. More sword! Woo! Okay. Uh, pick that up. You <laughs> heard you like swords, so we put swords on your swords while you... I don't even know. <laughs> I got the reference, but that's... It's too hard to craft. I'm, I'm dumb. This early in the morning, my brain's not functioning. There's a couple down there, I think. Yep. This little shit's using a bow. That's cut you down. Or cut your head off, that works too. I like how his head turned to, like, realist by the uh, time the sword cut through. <laughs> that was fun. Realist. Yeah, that's, that's a way to use English, Tom. God damn it. When will my brain return from the war? That is what I'm asking. Hey, found a gold ore. Cool beans. And that's a battle axe. Don't need that. Didn't want that. Uh, I'll drop that. Because I don't want that. Whoop. Okay. This, a sword I might pick up. Because I might give everyone in my house one of these. Because they're cool. They're kind of cool looking. They're not really practical in the hilt and the guard I mean. I mean look at that. That does not look very practical. I mean at least on the bottom part. The top part maybe but it'd be much it'd be much more effective you know taking that extra point off the little one that's protruding out there but you know that's just my own analysis and I've you know never claimed to be an expert just what makes sense to me, which usually is not too much. And off your head goes. Uh, ectoplasm. <laughs> ah ha. Ha ha ha. Alright. I'm weird. <laughs> That's what I am. Get fucking used to it. Ooh. Carrots. Uh, salt pile. I could always use more salt. Let's be perfectly honest here. We could always use more salt in our lives. Yay! More salt. I'm just going to search all of these in case I have salt. Because salt is good. Salt, 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 salt! Uh, but it, Oh! The dead person here. Why do you have dwarven gauntlets? That's weird. You're weird. Uh, nope, that's not going to work. We'll go this way now. I'm pretty sure there's something over here. There always is. Is that a... Yeah, that's a minor healing. Oh, shit. Let me cut you down. Okay, that worked. That one worked. And now I need to... around and get this one. Oh. So, now he's putting all his effort on me. Okay. Well, I'll take one of these. I know this won't work, but I might as well try it. Take this... And one of these, and one of these. Come on, damn it. Okay, so that one is a uh, very strong one. This one's probably Scourge. Yep, that's a hulking dragger. Let's see if you can get that through the wall, bitch. Haha! <laughs> okay. Let's have a little bit more extra healing on me, as well as some more stamina. That's always good to have, right? Right? Eh, okay. It's regeneration. What else could I be using right now? Whoa, he hit for a lot. I just realized he hit for a lot. Goddamn. Um, 
fug, 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 fug. It's not good. It's not good. I don't have anything to combat that. At least not a lot. Um. Store health. I have vigorous healing. Don't want to use that, by the way. And I guess I'm kind of stuck there. And that should kill him very soon. Uh, pop one of some of these, just in case I'm wrong. Alright. Hey, Vigorous Healing! That last one was free, then. Who sold him pregnant? And this is a honed ancient Nord Sword. So... It doesn't really look that different from... Whoop, from the regular Nord Swords. Just stay a lot more sharpened, apparently. And I'm trying to get a good look at it on the camera. See, uh, it's not really that much different in uh, look. There's still a little rough spots on it. But it's a, a lot stronger and can't be upgraded like the uh, other ones can to the Nord Hero Swords. But, you know, if you like holding old swords on you for, like, RP reasons... It's a good sword to have. Uh, let's see if we can unlock this trap trigger real quick. Get out of the way. Ah, da, ba, da, ba, da. Ti, ti, ka, ka. There we go. Woo! That's out of the way. All for 26 fucking gold. Wow! Alright. Motherfucker. <laughs> That's how reward goes in this game sometimes. Sometimes you do something real cool and it just is not worth it. Not worth it. Is there anything over here? No. Nothing I missed? Okay. Just making sure. Uh oh. Woo! That was close. That's a, a burnt corpse. I assume that's one of the... Uh, That's the Imperials that came before me. And I assume this is one of the random adventurers that came before me. This is probably another one that came before me. A bunch of dwarven bows. Iron arrows. That's what I meant to say. Hey, and that's the way back into here. There's a little loop around. There we go. It's a way to come back should you need to go out and deal with stuff. I doubt you will need to. Ah, there we go. The crypt, which is where we're headed to get that damn mask. Uh, it's one of those days, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right. We'll head through here. This is a Draugr that got killed pretty hard. Has someone seen me? Oh, I see. Okay. Okay, let's see. Broke his... That broke his guard. And we... Freaking ran him through. That's good. Okay. See if there's anything we can pick up. Hey, common soul gem. Cool beans. Yep. That's not great. Yep. That was not what I meant to do. I meant to press sprint, but I forgot that's not the sprint button. Used to destiny controls. Oopsie. Yeah. Though I haven't played destiny in the last few days. Uh, take that. Nope. That had nothing. Now, we could unlock this right away, but it'd be far more easier to get it, the key this way. I say far more easier, even though it might not be at all easier, because I don't quite remember this spot. Do I have that one thing I planned on taking? Yeah, I do. All right. Cool. Uh, take that. 
I'm just searching everything at this point because my brain is having one of those days. Whoa, hey! And down you go. Alright. Take what you got here, which includes that dagger. I didn't want the linen wrap. Why the fuck did you pick up the linen wrap? The cursor wasn't even on the goddamn linen wrap. Bah! It's a game sometimes. Linen wrap. There we go. It's a bunch of weight I don't need. And that's vigorous healing. Yay! That's barred from the other side, so that means I come back through here. And that has nothing. That has nothing but linen wraps. Cool. Ooh. Don't need all of that. It's cool to know it's there. Uh, there's a torch there. I'm making that what you will. Okay. Friends resolve. Uh -oh. That's a scourge. All right. Uh, let's pick up some of this stuff first. Okay, let's try and cut you down real quick. No, this is gonna get back for me very soon. That kind of makes it very obvious now. Um, oh boy, something's going to fuck me up, I'm sure of it. Uh, okay. Down you go. All right. Woo -hoo -hoo. That could have gone far, far worse. Could have gone far, far better. But that has nothing in it whatsoever. All right. I don't think I'm ready for this. I don't think I'm ready for this dungeon. I don't think I'm ready for this jelly. Okay. Okay. Is there another one coming? No. That was the only one over here. Cool. Yep. That's not what I wanted. What I'm going to do is search all of these, but I don't think there's anything in them. Oh, there's one. Ooh, garnet ring. So worth it. <laughs> This one's kind of worth it, though. I think. Oh, that... <laughs> doesn't have that sort of trigger. It's that sort of trigger. Okay. We'll head over this way, then. Is there anything in these? But this one. Ooh. Minor stamina. That's always good. This. Nope, nothing. Alright. It's the spot we just came from. Anything over here? Nothing. The hell am I doing? This. Nope, nothing there. Sometimes cobwebs are hiding things. Are you kidding me? I hate it when it does that. And down you go. That was quick. A lot quicker than I thought it'd be. Is there anything over here? Nope, nothing coming. Just their axe that went flying the other side of the little corner there. Okay, I'll take this. Oh, that's going to be throwing that stuff for a while. Emerald! Ow! Ow! God damn it. It's like comedy of errors right now. If you crouch, you pretty much get through this okay. Ow. There we go. Uh, great sword. Well, I'm pulling that out. And down you go. Whoo! That could have gone badly. Ice spikes. It's from a bandit. Really? How'd the bandit get this far in? I don't really know. It's a 
Weird little thing. Take that and that. Take the Rogger. Take that. And it's time to shoot a little firebolt over there. Set off the trap. So I don't have to deal with it. Okay, let's see if I can use up some of my magicka potions. Get all of that out of the way. I want to see if I can kill this guy with just fire. And I did! Cool. At least I know I can do it now. I'll down a few potions. And I'll call that the end of the episode for now. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And we can share, you can share and comment so we can talk about the games we're playing together. We can bring more people into this community to talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat, playing games for you.